your local weather with the KX News Storm Team. 615 on this Thursday morning. Welcome back to Good Day Dakota. Upper 40s today in Minot. That uh, record was set back in 1927 at 84, and we are looking at 54 for an average high for today. And then we head to the capital city where we're also going to be in the upper 40s today. Just a few degrees warmer than yesterday. Uh, less wind, and that's of course just slightly below that average. That record uh, set back in 1927, also at 84. Temperatures this morning are cold, upper teens to uh, some mid 20s here. In fact, we're now down to 16 in Crosby and 21 in Lake Chida, 27 in Rugby, and also we're looking at a little bit of a wind chill. It's not too low, but uh, our winds are. Light, so that's kind of helping us out in the windshield department. It feels like 12 this morning in Dickinson with winds uh, kind of light and variable this morning. That's really helpful. If the winds were even up a notch by five, six miles per hour or so. We might even be talking single digit wind chills. But that's not the case this morning. The winds later today will be mainly southerly, which is going to help us out. It'll help pull in some warmer air, and they do stay light. Temperatures mainly in the 40s this afternoon, some 50s in far western North Dakota, but we're going to see cloud cover kind of move in and out through the day today. Your highs, 50s there in the west, and also 40s for the rest of us here for central and eastern North Dakota. The satellite and radar pretty quiet this morning. We've got some clouds rolling in from the west, so those clouds move in later today, and you'll see the precision cast showing those clouds rolling in and later tonight ushering in a chance for an isolated shower or two as the temperatures cool in the overnight. Remember the coldest temperatures come before the sun rises. We'll see the possibility of a bit of a wintry mix, but I believe some of this, a lot of it still could fall as just a cold rain. We'll move this out of here. We'll get some sunshine on Friday. But lows tonight back down to the 20s and some low 30s in the southwest, so maybe not as cold. And tomorrow we start warming up a little more in the west there. Some 40s, 50s, even temperatures around 60 there off towards the far west. Your weekend preview, more of the same in terms of the temperatures, 40s and 50s on both days. We've got a chance on Saturday night and to early Sunday for maybe a quick little rain snow mix, if not a quick shower or two. Nothing that should cancel your plans. But we have an eventual warm up. Here's the upper atmospheric temperatures heading into the next few days. Nothing that's looking impressive here until we really get into next week and we'll see this ridge build over the upper plains. And that's going to promote some warming here. We will also see chances for some rain next week and maybe even some 60s. Here's the forecast in Dickinson. Temperatures looking to stay in the 50s here over the next few days. A little breezy on Saturday and quite possibly kind of windy in Williston on Saturday. Upper 40s for you. Might not your seven day forecast as we head into the weekend. Again, that wintry mix is certainly a possibility on Sunday morning with a few showers. Uh, for the latter part of the morning into the afternoon. And then you see there's some 60s make their triumphant return to the seven day. Bismarck also looking to see warmer temperatures for the next week. So we're kind of bottoming out here with our cold morning lows. And then we'll see a slight bump in temperature. Still pretty seasonable. Yeah, and Amber, as you know, and everybody watching at home, a lot of our reporters are imported from either the East Coast or mm -hmm. the South. Well, the East Coast reporters seem to be a little bit more prepared. Our Southern reporters, like Kaylin and Cameron, yeah, um, we need to maybe give them some tips. They're a little stressed out. They're like, yeah. well, I, I hear about this cold winter you guys have, and then we drop to the teens for morning lows, and it's a, it's a little taste, just yeah. a little taste of what we get in the winter. There will be a day, uh, and I will prepare them, there will be a day that I give teens for highs, and I say that's a warm-up. Yeah. That's North Dakota for you. Uh oh. Well, new normal, I guess. Yep. All right. Thanks, Amber. Keep it with us here on Good Day Dakota. Still to come, Minot voters, your voices.